Can you see it? Swipe for no swiping. Uh uh. Rock, paper, scissors. scissors. I just want to win. Shoot. I win. What do Muslims do when they disagree with someone? Today, two contestants will go through the gauntlet. Five challenges round by round of games and trivia to remind us all of how the Prophet, peace be upon him, was the purest example of patience and how he spread Islam to his exemplary character. Today, on the Path to Patience Game Show. Let's meet our contestants. I can go. Uh, I can go. <laughs> no, let me go. Hi, everyone. My name is Rowan, or Rowan in Arabic. I am 19 years old, and I live in Blaine, Minnesota, with a family of seven. I am right now studying at the University of Minnesota, studying architecture, take part in a lot of teaching, and extracurricular activities. Hi guys, my name is Rauda or Rauda. I'm 20 years old, also the University of Minnesota. I'm studying computer science in my last year, inshallah. For hobbies, I love sleeping. <laughs> We've been sharing a room since the day we were born. <laughs> she is what, a year and a half? We're Irish twins, I think. So we do get into a lot of not fights, but we, we argue. There are disagreements lot. for sure. Yes, because we see each other all day, every day. Every. We drive together, fool together. We have the same friends, we have the same taste. It's all the same. She's just taller. <laughs> yeah, I am taller. <laughs> Where these questions are going to appear like this. You will choose your answer by displaying your cube or your dice with the appropriate number. Yes. Pretend that the answer to the trivia question is two. You both selected two. Congratulations. All right, are we ready for trivia question number one? Yes. Yes. All right, here we go. Who expressed disdain for Islam repeatedly throwing garbage and harmful objects in the Prophet's oh. path? Hey. <laughs> Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, once had a neighbor, Abu Lahab. He and his wife abused our Holy Prophet for years. One day, he... Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, noticed there was no garbage at his door. And out of concern, he went to check and found that his neighbor was sick. The woman was in awe at his compassion and forgiveness despite how she had abused him and she eventually accepted Islam. In our next game, contestants have to prove their patience in a game we're calling Perishable Patience Playoff. What I'd recommend Live. is- Is my phone? Yeah. Is it Princess, <gasps> Princess Charm School! Barbie, Princess Charm School! The first person to step off of that spot will lose the challenge. Okay. Good luck. You want a handshake again? Barely. Start playing fair as oh, you're shaking my hand. We should make a. Ba la 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 la. Baymax. Baymax. Big Hero Six. It's not Baymax. <laughs> okay. How the house school today? You guys, I have my assignment due tomorrow. Actually, no dog zero. <laughs> 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 I think for me, the story that really just resonates is the story of the year of sorrow. Khadija radiallahu anha passed away, and then right after she passed away, Abu Talib, which is the uncle of the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam, passed away. And at the same time, the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam had traveled to Ta'if, and in this land, he was being made fun of, oppressed, and through all of this, through through all his hardship. He still had patience and faith in Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and his plan. We might get some Fs from school, have a bad day, but always have patience, understand that Allah has a plan for us. Jibreel alayhi salam came to the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wasallam and he told him, Iqra. And the Rasul sallallahu alayhi wasallam doesn't know how to read, so he was saying, I can't, I don't know how to read. When he was getting revelation, you know, he doesn't know what's going on. Someone's telling him, read. He doesn't know how to read. Then he ran home Went to his wife's his arms and was saying, cover me, cover me. That entire time, he didn't lose hope in Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. He had trust in him and he exemplified a lot of patience in that. He just knew that there's a plan and he just got to trust it and have to look good. It's, it's amazing to see how someone has that, that amazing of character or just patience. the ability to, yeah, to be patient yeah. in such hard times. Okay. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala told Prophet Musa alayhi salam of this servant who possessed special knowledge and wisdom. Oh. Is it Hither? Is it Dawood alayhi salam? Is it Ibrahim alayhi salam? You can't just copy my <laughs> answer. Point? How do you know that? I remember the story uh, about how Musa um, alayhi salam kept asking 
uh, and he was very knowledgeable, so he kept asking him why he was doing certain actions, and his answer was continuously have patience, have patience, or just, just don't ask questions. Here's the thing. There are so many times when we are like Prophet Musa Laysam in that story. And things happen and we can't for the life of us understand why. Just like Prophet Musa Laysam said, hey, why are you putting a hole in the boat? We might in our heart wonder, oh Allah, why is this happening to our brothers and sisters in Palestine? Why did my mom or my dad lose their job? Or why did my grandma or my grandpa get sick? And whenever we wonder, we should remember how Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is more knowledgeable than us. And even if we don't know the reason, we can trust that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala does. Assalamu alaikum, Brother Amin here. I hope you're enjoying the video. Quick request, if you're enjoying it, hit the like and the subscribe button. YouTube tells us that more than 50% of you aren't subscribed and we get super motivated when you do. Hit the subscribe button and enjoy the rest of the video. Assalamu alaikum. Our next round of trivia is worth three points and it requires three dice to answer the question. So the first contestant to find two more dice will win this round. Go. <laughs> Dude, that's not gonna work. What? Oh, she took mine. <laughs> not fair. <laughs> you can't take mine. Wait, maybe there's more. I found one. Look at that. You already have three. Hold on. <laughs> oh, you found four. Oh my gosh. Now you're just being greedy. I'll let you have one. Thank you. So I'm gonna go to the next question, and it's gonna have three dice on top. Are you okay. all right? Okay. Yes. What is the term used to describe having the right intention before performing oh, oh. any action? I got it, I got it, I got it! Wait, 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 we remain grounded and at peace, even when outcomes are uncertain. And contestants, get ready to face uncertain outcomes in a game that we're calling Nor Kids Yahtzee. Ooh. Yeah. So here's how Yahtzee's gonna work. Each of you are gonna score points. Four categories in which you score. Total score will win the round. Okay, do we roll them at the same time? Like all, all three? Right, take turns one by one. Okay. All right, I'm the tall one now. <laughs> you can see the height difference. I'll tell you what number you got. It won't really help you. Okay, you got a seven. I don't want. <laughs> oh, you're about to hit it off the table. Oh, you rolled a. What is it with you in pairs? Yes! Wow. Okay, wait. Do I look. Do I just look nice? Your eyes a little crooked. Ya Rabbi, Bismillah. Please, I just want to win. Did I get off the table? No, okay, I okay. hit the table. Oh, I got a pair. Wait, I'm more! Are your eyes open? No. <laughs> bismillah, 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 bismillah. Ya Rab, I want a better score than I want. That was close. Sifr. Nine again. Sifr, sifr, I'm sifr, on sifr. straight. You want to move your dice? <gasps> my eye fell off. I'm just going to be winking at everyone. Can you let me know if my eye falls off again? <laughs> okay. I'm just going to do this fast and easy, like fast. Ready? No, oh, eight. so I got, yeah, I didn't get. So I'm oh one. Oh my God. <laughs> Is about to fall off? No. I'm trying to trick you. Like, you know how... <laughs> it's okay. So I needed a four. Makes sense. So you're taking yeah. zero this round for one so of these three. I'm gonna go for the Yahtzee. Oh. I'm a big bala. You oh my gosh, my eye! You put my eye back. Yeah. Can you tell I'm winking at you? <laughs> what number was it? I'm not telling you. Oh my gosh, you no! were so close! It literally went like this. 
No, okay. Uh -uh. I want to take a zero for a straight. We're both going for yachts. Whoever's watching, make da for me, okay? And if you're gonna see this after, make the da anyways. Was that off the table? No, you're good. <laughs> you're supposed to be closing your eyes. My eyes are closed. I'm trying to feel the four. <laughs> oh okay, okay, five. Where's the other one? Give it back. <laughs> you're not gonna feel the number. Okay. Bro, you cheated! No, I didn't. You cheated! My eyes were literally closed. Well, I can't tell. I saw your eyes blinking the entire time. <laughs> they were closed. I think my eye is gonna... Can you hold yeah, it? Yeah, I'll hold it. Okay. We got her. What number is it? Two. Two? Okay. Where are you looking? At you. Because <laughs> you're trying to see my <laughs> I thought the eyeball in my hand. What number is it? Three. Oh. <laughs> Let me go for a straight. I take back what I said last <laughs> round. Okay. Well, what is it? <laughs> I win! I win! Good game. There you go. Good game. I was holding your eye for you. No, you guys. Alhamdulillah, Allah gave me two eyes. That worked. I don't need it. Well, actually, I can't actually do want one. Boing. I that's what I was gonna do. <laughs> I'm gonna fly you away. <laughs> so you have a shield, and then you also will be holding a Nurk Kids backpack. Backpack. Is it heavy? Backpack. Ooh, did you go downstairs and steal these bundles? You know my backpack is heavier than this. Backpack, backpack. Oh, wait. Swiper, no swiping. <laughs> back, 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 back. Yella, ready? I can't grab mine. How am I gonna grab it? There you go. Use backpack, that. Backpack, backpack. <laughs> backpack, 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 backpack. Yo. Wow. Yeah. I have 15 more books that you need to add to your bag. Oh my gosh. Ah. Vroom, 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 vroom. Get out, Mika. Oh. 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 Ooh. Ooh, you gotta be. You gotta be. Quick, <laughs> Bags of rocks. My purse of rocks. Let's do an unboxing. Let's of my do what's in my purse. Where's the zipper? I have sedimentary rocks. What was it? Sedimentary rocks. What was it? Sedimentary rocks. <laughs> you have. Igneous. I have jade. It's I have rock. diamond. <laughs> How did our holy prophet, peace be upon him, respond when the Quraysh. Wait, I thought we were going to wait for gold. Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, built bridges between people including those who initially rejected his message, like the Quraysh. Although he did not physically build a bridge, he worked tirelessly to foster understanding, reconciliation, and peace, even with those who opposed him. His emphasis on dialogue, patience, and forgiveness helped to bridge the divide between the Muslims and the Quraysh over time. You will be creating a path where there was not one, in a game we're calling Play-Doh Bridge Builders. In this game, you will be given Play-Doh and a few Jenga blocks and newer kids' books. Mom, what happens when we die? That is an excellent question. I know. I have a book for that. Afterlife. Gotta be here somewhere. Here we go. Happily ever hereafter. The end, says Dad. But I don't want it to end. I want you to tell me the story forever. But is you gotta have books that span this whole gap. Oh. The first person to complete the bridge wins. Don't hit mine over this time, please. Oh yeah. Mom. Oops. What? <laughs> that was on That's accident. Not fair. No, no. You have to start yours. No, well, that was on accident. You have to start yours. I over. win. <laughs> you keep hitting mine. It's not fair because I said that. Well, I guess we're restarting. I, I, I believe that you won't do it again. Oh, you're smart, but I can't copy you. Ha ha ha. Yes, I can. <laughs> Why can't I? <laughs> I mean, I was thinking of breaking the sticks, and uh, and but maybe there's not enough books for all of us. Ta-da! Wait, if I go like this? What? Girl, it's not you're <laughs> just copying exactly what I'm doing. Put the book on it, so then now, I'm gonna wait.
win. Check I'm gonna win. And so this next one is also just a true or false question, so there's only two answers. Ready? Yes. Yes. True or false, the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, said in a hadith, treat other people the way they themselves would like to be treated. Wait. I, I'm going to have to watch it, uh, a replay. Tab? Too long. Let's just do rock, paper, scissors. <laughs> no, I lost last time. Have faith. Pick your sign. Oh, you can see it in there. Oh, yes, you can. Tell me what you're going to put up. I'm going to put, I'm gonna put rock. rock. Three, two, two one. one. Yes! I win This is why I told you I'm not doing rock, paper, scissors. Watch the video back. Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, has said in a hadith, whoever wishes to be saved from hell and admitted into paradise as desired, they should believe in Allah in the last day and treat other people the way they themselves would like to be treated. That's why I'm letting you win. Because <laughs> I want to win. I remember learning about that hadith in one of my schools. And it's the golden rule, treat others how you want to be treated. It is important for us to be kind and respectful to others, regardless of their beliefs and opinions, even if they are different from ours. A simple practice in kindness and respect are the words thank you and I'm sorry. Contestants in this next game, you will be using these words in a game we're calling politeness skee-ball. You have nine total throws to score points. I'm gonna aim for you first. Thank you. Oh! I'm sorry. I'm gonna go for my... <laughs> so I get three points for nice. Me. No problem. <laughs> Since you went for me, I will go for you first. Thank you. And you're welcome. Now my turn. <laughs> Bismillah. Oh. Bismillah. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay, ready? I'm gonna close my eyes. Why? Because. Wow. You didn't want to give me the point, huh? Oh, <laughs> I'm sorry. Try it again. Oh. Oh. At least you got what? One I point? got one point. Bismillah. Oh, she got Ooh. three. <laughs> Bismillah. Oh. Oh, it's okay. I was trying to get you. Yes, these are my last three throws. I tried to teach myself how to juggle while hula hooping and then jump roping. I don't know what I was doing. Okay, maybe I you're heard good. Her, I'm like... sorry. Ooh, oh, you're no. really close. Okay, I got one, got point. one point. That was six. Close. Ralda, you have three throws. Come on, Ralda, get the five. Get the five. We want the five, right? Okay. Okay, Bismillah. <gasps> oh. oh. You made it look so easy. Yeah, how'd you get the five? So I'm sorry, you didn't get. Hey. <laughs> hey, I was. I'm sorry, it's okay, you didn't get it. Oh, why are they bouncing out, out of all? Oh. It's these sedimentary work rocks. out. No, no, these are gold, remember? This is gold. My sapphire and my gate. In Surah Al-Isra, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala tells our holy prophet, peace be upon him, and tell my servants to say that which is best, courageous gossip. That's correct. Say that which is best. Allah is giving guidance to all believers through the Prophet Muhammad, reminding them that shaitan tries to create discord. The surah emphasizes the importance of compassionate communication in order to maintain peace and harmony. So contestants, say your best, because it will be your last. Because from here on out, you will have a spoon in your mouth. I like talking though. Bismillah, Allah's on my side. I love my family, I love you guys. Please, if I don't make it past this, do my bed, please. My mama on TV. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so if that ping pong ball drops or you step off that spot, you are eliminated. We are now going to add blindfolds. We are going to one foot. Is everybody ready?
<laughs> no, I lost. Bro, I was like, she couldn't the, stay the on. spoon was about to fall out my mouth. I was, if I just lasted five more seconds. Round up. And that's all. Bye, guys. Make sure to subscribe to like this video. Share it with your friends. Back. Make God for us. <laughs> we got you in our dogs.